Hey everyone, Kevin here. Big update, Donald Trump was just directly asked about stimulus checks. That is the second round of stimulus check. Finally, I have so many times lamented over the idea that why doesn't somebody just straight up ask him in the questions and answers, is there gonna be another check? Well, that uh, happened today. Let's look at the answer and then let's break down what he means by his answer because his answer is not as clear as it should be. It is a political answer. So I'm gonna play it through once without interrupting as hard as that is for me. <laughs> but I will break it down afterwards and the analysis afterwards is very important obviously in my opinion, but I'm kind of talking about myself there. So let's go ahead and pop it up on screen right here and listen to it. Mr. President, what are your thoughts about a second round of direct payments to Americans that's included in the, uh, the House Democratic bill? Well, we're talking about that with a lot of different people. I want to see a payroll tax cut. I want to see various things that we want. I want uh, the workers to be taken care of, but we are talking about that. We're negotiating with the Democrats. We'll see what happens. But uh, as I said, it's a transition, and it's a, this is really going to be, in my opinion, we'll see. But I think it's going to be something that's going to be very special. It's a transition to greatness, and greatness is next year, right from the beginning. I think we're going to do fantastically well. Uh, I view the third quarter, as I said, as a transition quarter. Could be pretty good, but a transition quarter uh, toward the end of the Fourth quarter, you're going to see some numbers that are going to be tremendous, I think. And next year, you're going to have uh, potentially the kind of numbers that you saw before and maybe even better because there is that pent-up demand that is, uh, you know, a lot of people wanted to do things. They were ready to do things, and they've had to hold back because of the virus. So I think you're going to have, with that pent-up demand, a phenomenal year next year. Unless somebody messes it up, by coming along and raising taxes, doubling, tripling, quadrupling your taxes, like a certain party, namely the Democrats, want to do. You'll mess it all up. You know, we had the greatest in the world. I presided. This administration presided over it. It got great for a reason. And we'll do it again. And we'll do it again very quickly and very easily. I see that happening. Okay. Let's now break this down because he didn't clearly give us an answer here, but he did something very special. I'll play it back in a moment. But at the beginning, when he was first asked the question, he gives a nod and a slight smile indicating that at least subconsciously, Ah, yes, this question, here it is. Here's the question I've been waiting for. I'm surprised I haven't been asked this sooner because yeah, we have been talking about this and we've been talking about this a lot, but then his subconscious comes out, but wait a minute, I cannot answer this and say, yes, we'll do another check because who's been the only one rallying for extra stimulus right now in terms of, well, extra stimulus checks. The only ones actually saying we want more stimulus checks are Democrats. He can't hear say, yes, we're gonna have more checks because then it carte blanche hands over a victory to the Democrats. It has to come across as a negotiation. This is why the Federal Reserve says, you guys just, just think big, okay? Keep, keep being you. But like, get to it and think big. This is why you hear the treasury secretary and you hear economic advisors saying, we're in talks, we're in talks. You know, we're worried about liability protections. We're worried about this. This is why you hear Mitch McConnell not saying there won't be more checks, but you do hear him say, you know, we wanna see how things are being spent right now. This all leads up to election talk. There's a reason Donald Trump goes from, yes, we're in talks about extra rounds of stimulus, excuse me, about stimulus, and he goes into talking immediately after that about unless somebody messes it up. That is, yes, we're talking about stimulus checks. Our country will be great. We're going to go through a transition to greatness. And next year, things are going to be great unless because the AKA Democrats spend too much money, they have to tax the crap out of this country to pay for all the money they spent. And then all of a sudden the country's not great anymore. That is the implication he is sending. He's sending that loud and clear. But this by far, now politics aside, right? I'm just trying to distill this. Uh, this by far to me, 
is the clearest signal, clear as day, that to me, I believe Republicans and the president and Democrats are all on the same page that, yeah, we should probably expect at least another uh, check, maybe even two or three, but we're just waiting to see what that Democrats bill is gonna look like right now. And then that way they could start that negotiation. I wouldn't be surprised if they come out uh, hard at first saying, no, 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 no way, no way are we gonna do that unless we get this, this, and this. Basically, the way I see this ending is Republicans like, agreeing to additional stimulus checks. Once they win on things like liability protections and uh, possibly some other things like paycheck protections and infrastructure, now everybody can go back to their district and go, look, I'm a winner, I got you checks. Look, I got you infrastructure. Look, I got you liability protections. Everyone wants to come out a winner. But let's go to that nod because that's a big one here. I want you to see this and tell me what you think about this in the comments below. I like looking at psychology like this and it's this kind of psychology that I teach you how to use to make money when you're negotiating in real estate or you're thinking about buying stocks and getting into the market. Uh, I teach you that in the links below, which is of course right next to the link for uh, Weeble. <laughs> where if you deposit uh, $100, you get two free stocks with Weeble and of course, Get your quote for life insurance and sign up within five minutes by swiping Apple Pay on your phone. Let's look at the nod here though. This is where the question begins. Let's turn the volume up first. President, what are your thoughts about a second round of direct payments to Americans that's included in the, uh, the house? Did, did you see that? To me, that's really important. Like, I know where you're going with this. Okay, I've been waiting for this question. This, this is important. Let's talk about this and let's address it. He doesn't shake his head no. Like, yeah, no, that's not gonna happen. It's a Democrat dream. He does not do that. Let's watch it one more time and let it play a little bit longer this time. Your thoughts about a second round of direct payments to Americans that's included in the, uh, the House Democratic Bill? Well, we're talking about that with a lot of different people. I wanna see a payroll tax cut. I want to see various things that we want. I want uh, the workers to be taken care of. Notice exactly what he did here. And we'll, we'll end it on this. We'll just think about this for a moment. Well, he nods, acknowledging this, kind of implying that, yeah, this is a big thing. Yeah, we probably realize we're going to have to do this. And, and he says himself, but we wanna see worker protections. We wanna see a payroll tax cut. We wanna see these other things. So notice how he's actually summing up the debate for you in his response. Yeah, we are talking about that, AKA we are debating about that. But remember, these are the things we're fighting for, AKA Trump and the Republicans. This is a really good signal in my opinion. I could not be happier to uh, put this video out. I hope you appreciate it. Again, if you like this kind of content, hit the subscribe button. We know we've got CARES Act uh, number two coming up to the uh, table here. It is on deck very, very soon, either later today or tomorrow. So stay tuned for that, folks. I'm excited. Let's, uh, <laughs> let's see some progress for once. Golly. All right, thanks for watching, everyone. Until next time, bye.